We live in a 24-hour news cycle. So much breaking news, it's hard to process it all. Well, ladies and gentlemen, we found a way to put the day's news in perspective with the help of our good friend, Mr. Dion Cole. <laughs> All right, at the Republican debate last night, Donald Trump said he opposed raising the minimum wage and claimed we're actually paying people too much. Does Donald Trump know what it's like to be poor? I don't think so, no. Did his kids ever get an IOU from the Tooth Fairy? I don't, I don't think so, <laughs> no. Did he make $15 million sitting on his rich orange ass telling people you're fired? He did, yeah. Then tell that racist Oompa Loompa to shut the hell up. In other news, critics say presidential candidate Ben Carson lied in his autobiography when he said he was offered a scholarship to West Point. Doesn't everybody exaggerate sometimes? Well, yeah, not everybody, but yeah. Didn't you just tell this audience we had a great show tonight? <laughs> yeah, I did, yeah. And besides lying, isn't that 90% of being a president? Yeah, I guess it kind of is, yeah. <laughs> then tell all those critics to leave that crazy man alone and shut the hell up. <laughs> Here's a good story. People are criticizing Jeb Bush because when a reporter asked Jeb if he would go back in time, would he kill baby Hitler, Bush replied, hell yeah, I would. Does Jeb Bush want to be president? Yes, he does, yeah. And is having George Bush as a brother ruining his chances? Well, yeah, that's kind of what they say. So if Jed had a time machine, would he kill baby Hitler or baby George oh, Bush? Oh, God, okay, that's, <laughs> that's hard to say. Then tell Jed Bush to shut the hell okay. up! Hey, hey. In other news, the Navy's being criticized for conducting missile tests off the coast of California without giving residents any warning. Hold on, hold on, Conan. I'm mm -hmm. still stuck on this time machine travel thing. Okay. okay, Dion, you're supposed to be commenting on the news. I know I am. Just hear me back. Hear me out for a okay. second, all right? I just, just stop the damn desk. Stop the damn desk. Stop it. Check it out. If Jeb Bush did go back in time to kill baby Hitler, there would be no World War II, right? Right, right. Which means Jeb's father would not have been a war hero, okay. right? Where are you going with this, Dion? No war hero, no presidency, no Bush dynasty. So Jeb would have no chance of being president. Hmm. So if you really think about it, Jeb Bush really needs baby Hitler more than anyone. Dion, do me a favor, let's just get back to the news. This is all crazily hypothetical. Time travel is impossible, okay? Is it, Conan? Is it? <laughs> anyway. Where was I? Where was I? Oh, yeah! Last week, the Navy conducted missile tests. Some people got scared and thought they were UFOs, so naturally they were very upset. The Navy says they were actually- I did it, Conan, I did it! <laughs> okay, what have you done, Dion? I went back in time! And guess what I got? I don't know what you got. Baby Hitler! <laughs> Would you please, please get baby Hitler, oh, please oh, get baby Hitler out of here. Oh, 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 one last thing, one last thing. And to everyone who said I couldn't invent time travel, tell them they all need to shut the f up. All right, Dion Cole. We went too far. Dion Cole, ladies and gentlemen. And time traveling, baby Hitler. We got a great show tonight. Academy Award nominated actor, author of the new book, Bream, Give Me Hiccups and Other Stories. Jesse Eisenberg is on the show. <laughs> Wasn't that a great clip? 
subscribe to my YouTube channel for an endless supply of me. <laughs> Ugh.